qualifying for the Gainesco Auto Insurance Indy 300 just wrapped up, and it looks like our three-time winner, Dan Weldon, is going to have a little bit tougher time making it four as he did crash in turn four of his qualifying run. But in other crash news, we're happy to report that Jay Howard is not only okay, but he has been cleared to drive, which, of course, came after he was quoted saying, if I'm breathing, I'm driving. The quickest of our transition drivers from the Champ Car World Series was Frank Pereira, who posted a starting position of 15th with Conquest Racing. But our fastest man tonight was Scott Dixon in the number nine Target Chip Ganassi machine with an average time of 213.341 miles per hour. Ed Carpenter and AJ Boyd IV were second and third, both which are career best starting positions for these guys. And Danica Patrick and Ryan Briscoe round out your top five. Don't forget to tune in to the Gaines Co. Auto Insurance Indy 300 Saturday night on ESPN2. But for now, here are some highlights. We had another crash, and this one by the man who's looking to win his fourth straight here at Homestead, Miami. Dan Weldon has made contact with the wall coming out of four. That happens. I mean, uh, you know, like uh, we, crashed, we crashed here in practice last year. So I'm sure we'll bounce back and we'll be fine. We've got a problem out on the track. That is Jay Howard driving for Marty Roth. He's a rookie this year. Came up through the uh, Firestone Indy Light Series. Vision Racing has come loaded. I've been telling everybody it's got to be the year we win. We've, uh, you know, we've proven we can run up front, top five, top three. So we got to, you know, break the barrier and get that first win. Right now, Ed Carpenter on a very good run. The guys put in a lot of work this off season, and you know it showed it showed in qualifying, and I think it'll show on race day tomorrow night. So you know it's just it's a good you know we have new sponsors with Menards and John Manville and everybody Direct TV, and it's just it's good to, to give them a good first night. You know today was the first day anyone had seen our new yellow car on track, and I feel like we did them a good job. And Scott Dixon has uh, laid down the gauntlet, Scott Goodyear, because he just laid down a four-lap average, 213.3 miles an hour. That's over a mile an hour faster than Danica Patrick in the number two. I was waiting for the other guys, like Dan, to uh, to lay some fat laps down. And he looked very quick, so it was unfortunate with what happened there. And it could have been maybe a one-two start for for us. And then once the, uh, you know, started to cool down a bit there, and a lot of, a lot of cars started picking up speed. But fantastic starts, exactly what we wanted to do, uh, you know, is come out strong and then hopefully come away with some good points at this race.